next up is Mark Hobson from Somerset. Hi, Mark. How are you? Okay. You are well, a flight you. attendant. Certainly am. Yes. And your special subject is the TV sitcom Only Fools and Horses. That's right. Yes. yes. Okay. I got to say it. Lovely, jubbly. <laughs> and let's hope you don't turn out to be a plonker, Mark. I so good. <laughs> are you ready to play? Yes. Ready. Let's play. This is the People versus Mark Hobson. What is the main unit of currency in Bolivia? Pass. The Boliviano. In which year did the Gulf War take place? Careful. Pass. 1991. Who had a UK number one single in 1988 with Groovy Kind of Love? Phil Collins. Correct. The way to do it. Wait for the one you know that you know. <laughs> I thought You've... it was 1991, but I wasn't sure. Not so. worth the risk. You've no. got 100 quid, and that took you 20 seconds, and you haven't dipped into your fools and horses. Into round two, round two, which has tripped up the previous two contestants. <laughs> Take it easy, Mark. Yep. First question. What is the second largest country in the world? Pass. Canada. Dendrology is a scientific study of what? No idea, pass. <laughs> Trees. Which musician's face is on the reverse of the £20 note launched in 1999? Pass. Edward Elgar. Go look at the two. Which author said, work is the curse of the drinking classes? Can I flip, please? Flip Oscar Wilde's the answer. Which street is celebrated in the song during the closing titles? Cookie Street. Correct. One more now, Mark. Who played the female lead in the film Grease 2? Michelle Pfeiffer. Correct. Uh, what man under 40 doesn't know Michelle Pfeiffer? There you go. Well done. You're through round two. 250 quid. Uh, you did use one of your flips, but yep. you're doing fine for time. So you've, you've broken that duck there. You're through. Okay, round three, we're looking for three correct answers, Mark. Okay. And remember, your first mistake is your last mistake. Your first mistake. What is the name of Paul Daniels' assistant, who is now his wife? Be Debbie McGee. Correct. Who was the lead singer of The Who? That'd be Roger Daltrey. Correct. Sue and Sweep are the friends of which famous TV bear? It's good old Sooty. Three out of three, you've got a hat trick. <laughs> that's worth £500, which is very nice. You didn't use any flips there, and you're doing well for time still. Round four. You up for it? Uh, I think I'm going to have to. Two flips? I think so. OK, looking for four correct answers, of course. Right. First question. How many packs of cards are used in the card game Canasta? Pass. Two. What name is given to a young eel? And Elva. Correct. Which king of England married Berengaria of Navarre in Cyprus? <laughs> Pass, no idea. You uh, have to flip. flip it's sorry. Richard the Lionheart. Here's your flip question. What is the name of the pub run by Mike Fisher? That would be the Nags Head. Correct. Who is the Queen's fourth born grandchild? Fourth born. Prince Harry. Correct. One more for £1,000. Which actor played D.S. Johnny Ho in the TV series The Chinese Detective? Flip. It was David Yip. Here's your flip question. Which character is played by Patrick Murray? Uh... Now take your time here. You're out of passes, you're out of flips. You've got plenty of time. You need this for £1,000. I can see him. I can see his face. Which character played by Patrick Murray? Oh, he's got the, the hat. It's mm, Mickey Pierce. <laughs> Bit of visualisation going on there. Yeah. Well done, Mark. You, you had to dive deep for that one, but Definitely, you got it. Yeah. You've got £1,000. You've got 1 minute 21 on the clock, but here's the big one. You used all your flips to get through round four. Flipped out completely. Do you want to stay or go? All flipped out and all questioned out, and I'm going to make a sharp exit, I think. Are you going to? Yes. Uh, no flips. Um, my wife would kill me if I went for it and lost it. So. Okay, well, listen, you certainly didn't make a plonk of yourself. You've got £1,000, Mark. Well done. The exit is there, and it's illuminated by the lights on the floor. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bye-bye.